Is everything you ask ChatGPT public? I get asked this all the time in the comments, so let's break it down. So you're told that your chats help to improve the model. So naturally you wonder who exactly sees them. Could they ever leak out? Well, no, your prompts aren't published online, but when you hit send, your text lands on an open AI server. So it is somewhere, but it's private from the outside world. It's all encrypted, but it's not invisible internally. Open AI staff and contractors can review random chat snippets to look for abuse or improve performance. They're employed under strict NDAs, but there's no such thing as perfect secrecy. And if law enforcement shows up with a valid warrant, they can look at it. Or if there's a hack, which you would hope is unlikely because OpenAI, I'm sure, have great security, always possible, your chats could be targeted. Now, here's the important bit. Unless you've disabled it, yes, your chats are used to train future models. You can switch that off in settings, data controls, improve the model for everyone, but it's only enterprise, teams, educational, or API users that get this no training ever guarantee. Everyone else, free users and ChatGPT plus subscribers, $20 a month, has their data kept for at least 30 days, and it's eligible for training unless you manually opt out. So what actually happens during training? How does that all work? Well, the model doesn't remember entire conversations and it doesn't really know the meaning of them. That's not how it works. It's just a machine. It breaks down text into tokens, which are these building blocks of language. And then it just learns which tokens tend to appear next to and near each other in sentences. And it's just predicting patterns. It's not understanding meaning. So if you say something very personal, like I feel really sad today, that means a lot to you. It doesn't mean anything to ChatGPT. And to be honest, it's seen that a million times. It's too generic to stick. But if you enter something really unique, like a social security, number, an API key, a password, some obscure company information, and the model gets trained on that, there's a small but real chance that it could regurgitate that exact phrase later, and that's called memorization risk, where the more unique the information is that you put in, the more risky it is, basically. Now, it is rare, but it has happened. Like Researchers have tricked these models into revealing real phone numbers, email addresses from training data, but a lot of the stories you hear about, this kind of jailbreaking, tend to be in older versions, but it's still happens. So the simple rule is don't paste anything in that's unique and you wouldn't want other people to see. So internal company data, sensitive personal info is a no-no. And also you don't want to lose your job for doing that at work. So if it needs to stay private, just don't put it in. But if your chats are pretty generic, like talking through your feelings or asking how to write an email, you're not feeding it anything risky because it's not unique. You're pretty safe. Your problems, I'm afraid, are generic. And that's in this case, a really good thing.